So as we look at our lofts here, of course you're going to separate your header loss from your uh, separating loss and your thrashing loss. And in here right away we know that six or seven bushels coming from the fact that we're not getting these light kernels off the cob. So that's going to be a setting in the concaves and, and getting it cleaned up and making sure you're not blowing corn out the back. Most of the loss that we're seeing here, 14 or 15 bushel, is butt shatter at the head. And a lot of times when we're talking about butt shatter, uh, it's going to be the speed of the head, the speed of the combining combination. So in the process of trying to reduce the butt shatter, that's coming from how hard the ear hits the deck plates. Of course, setting the deck plates is going to be important, as tight as you can. But a lot of times it also has to do with the speed, the speed that the head's running and the forward speed of the combine. If you're going too fast with the combine, you're going to see the stalks pushing forward as they come through the gathering change. If you're going too slow, it's actually going to be pulling them towards you. That stalk should go straight down through the, through the rollers if your speed is timed up. So as you can, sometimes you can speed the combine up a little bit and you can reduce the shatter loss by keeping that head fuller. In down corn, when the combine is running slow, we have to slow the head down. We've been able to take this 14, 15 bushel loss and cut it down to two bushel by slowing the head down. In this case, I had to put different sprockets on the head and putting some brush technology on the gathering chain to soften that blow and move those kernels up the head.